What's going on, guys? Welcome back to Card Talk. I'm Ryan, joined as always by Tyler and Lou. And today we're going to talk about day three. three. Day three at the National. I don't have a voice. Me either. This has been I, wild. I am wiped. Right wiped now. out. I'm I mean, wiped. drained. Fully gone. <laughs> I am mentally, emotionally, physically, and financially drained. My fingers hurt. I woke up this morning and I was like, I don't know if I'm going to be able to make it to the show. My legs were just on fire. A lot of people, it's been, a lot of people have come up and been like, I'm struggling. This, people are going to listen to this and be like, wow, they're not having fun. The <laughs> fact of the matter is we're having a great time. The blast. best time. We're just exhausted. What an, what, an, what an amazing 72 hours it's been. It's just nonstop. It's unbelievable. First and foremost. I got to give Ryan an immense amount of love for last night was insane, bro. This show has been incredible. The, the amount of people, the amount of demand, real transactions going down at scale. Jay has a camera in his hand and he's smiling. Lou, Great, don't post it. Then. Lou, you're going to always be looking left eye for the Jay. Yeah, he's like, IG this is the worst now. picture. It's like, so don't post it. Okay. Ryan. Yes. Give me something on trade night last night. You hosted a big evening. Crazy. Quite possibly the biggest. I was blown away at, not, I guess, the reach you have. I know the work that you've been putting in over the years, even since we first met, started doing this podcast, the growth, seeing all the people here, pent up after all the time. His people are waving at him right now. It was amazing. I mean, it's been unbelievable. Give me two seconds on last night. Give me a little synopsis. What did you see out there? What was happening in trade night? Yeah, kind of crazy, right? I, I've told the story that we, we started at 25 people in a little ballroom, hotel, meeting room in Atlantic City six years ago. Did you have Diet Pepsi then? Yeah, tons. You know, soft pretzels. I mean, we had so much. We had so few people come the mustard? first We had so many, so few people come the first night. We had like leftover cans of pop we were passing out to people. Warm? Last night, you were giving away warm Diet Pepsi? No, it was definitely cold. It was definitely sure? on ice. That, you would have, Yeah, you yeah would. but if, just because it's on ice doesn't mean it was on ice no, for a No, it was, it was on ice for a while. We have to pause. The third, the we're about to get buried. We're about to get buried by Atlantic City promo. But anyways. I knew it. <laughs> buried. This stays. If we get to hear the announcements, you get yeah, to hear listen, the announcements. <laughs> Rips. I, He's doing something. This has got to be the longest announcement in the history of announcements. Uh, it to happened do a, to us yesterday. To do, <laughs> yeah, yesterday was bad. To do a 13 minute... <laughs> To do a 13 <laughs> minutes to work close countdown is so excessive <laughs> and unnecessary. But, but yeah, trade night, right? A couple years ago, six years ago, drinks left over. Last night, we ran out of shirts, food, and drink in the first 10 minutes. We got to do synopsis, like wrap up, wrap up. What's your takeaway? Because um, what I'm saying is... I, I'm just here. <laughs> My man, Tyler, has 15 topics... And 15 points on each topic. Yeah. We get four minutes in, have a 13-minute announcement. What's the synopsis? I talk very briefly about Trey and I, and the next thing you know, it's time to What's wrap it up. What's the synopsis? I, I'm trying to say, Ryan, what? I'm, you talk about the t-shirts. I'm like, insane. People were out in the hallway on the floor. What's your takeaway from the show so What's far? your synopsis? Just the, the, the volume of people, right? Like... We've, we've talked about it before, right? You just hear the, the hobby is dead, the hobby is dead, the hobby is dead. You have 500 people waiting to get into trade night. Some of them waited since 3 p.m., three and a half er hours early, right? You don't have 500 people waiting for a trade night for a dead hobby. You look around here, it is shoulder to shoulder, right? It, it's wild. That's what's been the, the craziest thing from this is the volume of people. It's just this place is Packed. Packed. I agree. And it's, it was blown away. Walking in this morning, I'm like, wow. Lou, aside from the demand, what about cards? What about specific cards? What I do mean, you I mean, got, I got my cards, so I'm chilling. But in terms of, I, I did want to mention 
the sticker prices around the show have been a little bit high, from what I hear. Which tad, I guess is to high. be expected. Tad high here and there. Couple deals. Can make a play, but gotta, gotta look a little harder. I agree. You do have to look a little harder, and it's also like, this is the place you come to to find something you're not going to find anywhere else. Like, I went back and forth with a guy for like 20 minutes about a, a PSA 9 KD 2012 Silver that I had. And he's like, I've just never seen this anywhere. I've walked around here for two days. I haven't seen it. And we made a deal on it because it's like, he, he's not what sure happened? he's going to be able to you find it the bag. No, I thought I had, he said, stuff you don't see before. I, I, I made, a, made a couple nice plays on things I'd never seen before. So What'd you I, pick up? Nice Jim Brown auto. I got it from, uh, I'm going to butcher this. I'm not good with names. The gentleman that you talked to from uh, Sports Card Nonsense. Geo? Geo. Yeah. Made a play. It was Jim Brown, first year flawless, patch auto, on card, game used out of wow. five. I paid more than I wanted to. Tough bargain. That's a good card, though. We had a great Rare. conversation, and it was... Uh, They're good dudes. They came over the other day. They're nice you're, guys. You're not going to see another one. He even said that. It. It's like, you know, we were 200 bucks off, and I'm like... Who cares? Uh, who cares? Yeah. I, I'm not going to let this card go away, and he made a deal, and yeah. it, was, uh, it was cool. But that's, yeah, that's what I saw. It's like, it was probably, like I said, it was a little bit more than I wanted to pay, but uh, I've never seen another one, and it was such a nice card, and he was a good dude, and we had a cool conversation, so that was, uh, that was cool. I'm glad, I'm, I'm glad I bought it. What are you thinking about for tomorrow? Um, Tyler will not be here tomorrow. I, I wonder. I wonder as as the as the the day progresses, since you know Sunday's the last day. Are some people gonna be like, "Hey, maybe my prices are a tad high. Time to make some some deals." Yep. Right. You you want to give twenty percent off on bigger cards. You yep. want to you know unload some stuff in bulk. Yep. So you don't gotta take it home. What about dollar boxes? You want to sell dollar boxes 50 for cents. for ten cents in bulk. So you don't have to go home with them? 10 cents in bulk. 15 cents? 25 cents? Ryan loves a good 10 I'll, cent I'll, dollar I'll, box. I'm just saying. Bro, it's... your dollar box game over at that booth. First off, I walked by your booth three times today. There's a gazillion people mobbing you at all times. All right. Should I stop talking now? No. I'm trying to keep my words get your, to Get sing. your thought out. Every time I walk by your booth, it's five people deep around your dollar boxes. I mean, we agreed on that, just so we're clear. Yeah, it's been it's been crazy, right? We we brought a lot of inventory, a um, lot of different stuff, and we've been trying to trying to refill them. And I mean, we had thirty nine boxes of value stuff in dollar boxes, thirty nine total boxes. At, we had six or seven baseball prices marked boxes, so there was like four or five of them out. We no longer have cards to refill them. We've wow. like, I mean, we've gone through so much stuff. This and that's what's so good, right? Is like we talk about. There's a lot of people here. There are also a lot of deals happening. It's not like there are people that just want to, like, that Dallas show we went to when everyone just wanted to trade. Yeah. There are a lot of people buying at the yeah, show. Yeah, there's dollars. so many Tons. cards. But, Lou, you mentioned earlier you did not. What are you going to do tomorrow to change that? Did not sell enough? Yeah, you said you hadn't sell enough. What are you going to do tomorrow yeah. to change that outcome? I'll, I'll, I'll be more uh, agreeable to pricing changes. Interesting. Did you did you hold firm on a couple that walked away? I didn't hold like super firm, but I'm just like, hey, like you were more is, firm than the if number. you weren't firm. I was more firm than not firm. You were like medium plus firm. Like if we're talking about a mattress, you got soft, you got medium. You in got in firm. terms of steak, it was like a medium well firm. Understood. Mm. Need to be more at a you, medium you gotta, rare. Yeah. Medium rare tomorrow. Like get, I would like to get to medium. If you're tomorrow. not gonna go medium rare, you at least you gotta stay. Medium rare might be a little too far. But listen. But honestly, not many people come to these shows and, you know, adjust midway. That's, you know, that's... that's I'm a, a professional. That, I don't know what yeah, to say. that's great. That's great. So, um, I mean, that guy just walked right in front of the camera. That's unbelievable. <laughs> oh like, hey, here's his the camera. Cut, walk right amazing. in front of the camera. That's amazing. Have a good cut? day, bud. That haircut's good. Oh, oh. Brother oh. Lou, do not look at the <laughs> picture. Do not look well, at the picture. I can't react he, live he to the post. I can't react live to the post. Hold on. So, like, I'll make a comment. I'll make a statement. Well, it on. was a joke on Monday and Tuesday, whatever it was. <laughs> Today, I'm fucking annoyed. <laughs> and he's laughing. <laughs> and he's laughing. But it's not a joke. That is worse than the it's other It's ridiculous. Day. And he hides behind the account and no one gets to see Jay. So he thinks he can just post ridiculous pictures all the listen, time. Listen, Eventually, something bad is going to happen. Let's ground it. Let's, I mean, do, let's reel it in for a second. We're seven minutes in and there are already people crushing Lou saying... I guess Lou did not approve this pick. Yeah, like it's like, I definitely did not approve the pick. All right, Jay, we're going to have that meeting on Monday morning about a couple things. 
Um, but what I did want to ask is, this is the, I'm, I'm sad. I want to cry. I'm leaving tonight on a 9.15 flight. I'm going home for my buddy's 30th birthday. Whose birthday? Jake. Happy birthday, Jake. Happy birthday, Jake. But as I leave the show, there's a million things on my mind. And I don't want to hit you guys with the I mean, old soliloquy. Right in front of his face. This Cavs jersey, maybe, I think. Uh, what is on your mind leaving the show? Ryan. I know that Ryan's checking Instagram stories We've now. lost Ryan. Gone Ryan. Oh, Wait. Not. The show will be closing in 43 seconds. My question was, my man, what are you leaving the show with? Have you started to reformulate any new strategies? Is there demand in certain areas? Are you realizing how much overall demand there is? And you need to keep cranking volume because that's how you roll. But what are we leaving the show with? Thoughts wise. Football is on the rise still. I, I still like that. And I still am interested in the fringe market. Fringe. Yeah. F1, UFC, soccer. I mean, I'm putting soccer in there. Yeah. Um, right. I mean, just. Uh, hockey. Yep. I'm I'm still interested in some of those. I, you know, some of these other markets still are. are uh, yeah, I, I I think some football is a play. I, like I've said before, I I think some of these guys' expectations are through the roof. Yeah. Um, we've talked about that a lot, but yeah, there's a lot of a lot of juice in the in the card market right now. Uh modern day base soccer, Bellingham, Mukoku, all these guys that are walking around. Pedri, the ten new tops chrome stuff. At base, I can't stand it. I don't even want to look at it. I spent a lot of hours looking at it. I made a lot of good friends looking at it, but I told them all He's disgusted. I'm out on whatever you're trying to put in front of me. No thanks. What I was also surprised about was the lack of Marvel, Fortnite, entertainment, Mickey Mouse, Disney stuff. Maybe I live sometimes in this Twitter bubble sphere, but like I didn't see much like random stuff getting moved for anything that was worth a penny of what it may have been. And also, there's a lot of $350 price tag. You look, in the last five days, it did $270, $280, and the, oh, it's down that much. I'd rather keep it. Yeah, rather keep it. Cool. Big up on you. Like, respect. But... Prices change. It depends when you come in. And also, I sold a couple cards at L. I sold a Carmelo Refractor for 800 I bought that card for a grand. It went to two and took a bloodbath. $600, $700, $800 sales. Take it and move on. Stick and move. So, Ty, as we, uh, as we wrap this up, you'll be here tomorrow. I will. Lou will be here tomorrow. Uh, Ty will not. What final thoughts for... This year's national. It's been two years since we've been. You Final know, thoughts for this year's years national years was the um, we did was the immense amount of demand, people, interest in being here, not just to make money. There was so many people that came for the connections and the uh, you know we've been getting to know each other online and this merge of like online communities with in real life and. I had numerous three minute conversations with people before I realized that we've like are actually like online yeah, friends. Yeah, that's the tough part, by the way. But what I was going to say is I think that it, there's so much opportunity for this show to evolve, to cater to those interactions, nighttime events. I think that the stage, some of the production stuff, you know, could level up. Um, and I think we'll continue to see innovation. Like I said, on stage with these big brands, Rally, um, uh, Star Stock. PSA, like everyone is in media now and everyone needs to be doing deals and, and shows and, and sponsorships and all that. And I'm excited to see that all evolve. And I do just want to say that I, I went by the eBay booth today and it was ripping. They were giving away the ski cards and it was, it was like I need madness. To get me a pair of those. I need to get me a set of those. Yeah, you should. It was madness. So I'm pumped way, to see that. On eBay. They're selling. Like there's one at auction with like a couple of days left and it's at 80 bucks already. I know, right? Isn't that Dude, crazy? Dude, people were going crazy. The girls, the, the team I that to we give work me with. One of those sets? I got a set for you. Oh, man. I mean, how time? I'm moving my I way. I would love up. to get the fifth card. I got to go get the fifth card. Tomorrow. Yeah, the fifth card's going to be a tough look. 
I'll go with you. Um, but yeah, I'll that's what I got. That, that's what I'm excited to see the further development of this kind of show as a three day destination programmed out. You know, business development, partnerships happening, creators, you know, getting getting their share of things. And it's going to be good stuff. We sold like 45 T-shirts and I'm fucking pumped about it. It was great. Yeah. Can't wait till the next one. Atlantic City, we're coming near you guys. We are. I cannot Bigger wait. Bigger and better. Bigger and better. I if, cannot wait to sleep at a beach house and then wake up in the morning I know. and watch the show. That's just how Rosemont's pretty cool, too. Um, Maybe by then Jay will figure out the picture game. Probably not. Probably I'm not really though. annoyed at Jay. Overall, I'm going to say National was a play. This past year has been a play. I want to thank everyone. I want to thank you, Rye, for always holding us down. And, uh, yeah, man, it was just amazing to meet so many people. And I can't wait to be back. Show doors closed. That's it for you, boy. Yeah, let's get the schedule for Saturday. Let's get the, yeah, there we go. <laughs> 830. Uh-huh. I love these guys, but this is ridiculous. This is insane. This is the third time in our podcast. And this has only been for 14 minutes. They had three announcements in the last 14 minutes. They gave us a 13-minute warning until they were closed. So in 14 minutes, we had three announcements. I'm not even sure where Tyler can hear us. Lou and I are closer. I'm not sure Tyler can hear us as we sit here and talk about no, this. No, I know. I think it's just the Lou and Ryan podcast. I agree. Point. When there's announcements, we, I can't even. You're not even. Oh, yeah, no, no I did me. like distance I'm yelling a right bit. now. Yeah. Now yeah. I'm getting quiet again. Yeah. Hello. You want me to slide in? But Get in here? I, hopefully they're done. You want me to get in here for the sign off? All right. I think that's all we got for this one. I think so. Oh, this is our last one, right? We're not doing one, yeah. one tomorrow. No, this is our last so. one. Maybe you guys do a little something, but I'm out of here. Next one will be uh, Tuesday. Tuesday. Yeah. For a Wednesday release. People oh, love the boy. Wednesday release. Wednesday release is a play. It is a play. Oh, yeah. When we, when we went same day video audio, that was a big Omaha. Real quick. It was a big Omaha. Real quick. <laughs> predictions. When we, when we meet Tuesday, will Jay uh, have make a play ready or make a mistake on make a play or have a winner from three weeks ago? The way I feel about Jay right now, he'll huh? fuck up everything, <laughs> and that'll be how it goes. That is is a wrap. That's how we're going to end it. That's all we got for now, guys. Well, actually, my <laughs> last sign-off is Jay was making fucking plays. That's great. I seen the mans. Great. I seen them. No, right. but for real, that's all we got for now, guys. Peace out, everybody. Peace. Bye.